Hey y'all, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is your girl, Monday Nicole. If this is your first time tuning in, make sure you start what you're doing and you press that subscribe button. Also, make sure you click that bell for that notification link. So, hey y'all, as y'all already know, today is another collaboration. I am collaborating with one of my faves, Tiffany Baby TV. Yes, this beautiful woman right here so today we wanted to do something a little fun a little more exciting and we decided to both review green wigs for saint patty's day so y'all already know i found my lucky green wig so y'all make sure that after y'all are done reviewing this video make sure y'all go ahead and y'all check out her page she's so beautiful she's very supportive she's always if not maybe the first five people to comment under my videos or my statuses or my pictures she definitely gives great advice and she's just always you know that girl in the back just rooting for me just like i'm rooting for her and that's what i definitely love and appreciate about her because she's also very informative when it comes to her reviews and she tells the truth and she slays okay so today before we even get started on the hair review i am going to be answering three questions in regards to luck so the first question is what is my lucky wig so my lucky wig is lindsay lindsay is right here i'll make sure that i would post the link to this video in the description box below and so make sure y'all go ahead and check that out now the reason why this is my lucky wig because ever since i have been wearing lindsay i feel like a lot of great things have started to happen in my life in a positive way or it could be because I cut that X out of my life, which made a lot of blessings come in because I kind of was blocking them. But no, when I had put this wig on, it was after all that, all of that. And I was like a new chick. I was just more vibrant. I was more positive. I was just looking forward to my future and just, you know, making sure I stay fulfilled. And just working on myself day by day. Not only that, like great things on my job started happening. And I was able to travel a little bit. Just to, you know, relax and recharge up my soul. And, you know, just a lot of other things. And I just feel like because of this Lindsay wig, all these great things started happening. Or just these great things were supposed to happen. And I just happened to be wearing Lindsay wig. But, yeah, I get the point. So, the second question is do i believe in luck or chance i definitely believe in luck i feel like there are a lot of things that have happened in our lives that could have just easily happened to the next person but we happen to be there at the right place at the right time in that exact moment for us to rejoice in the joys of what we were looking for whether if it's you went to the casino you hit on the slot machines or the 21 blackjack or if you got a scratch off and you know you want some money or you found the closest parking spot to the entrance of the grocery store especially around this time because everybody <laughs> is a bit quarantined like i am and we got to make sure that we get all those house supplies or just waking up every day i feel like you are lucky now the third question is what is my lucky charm my lucky charm is my lip gloss now this lip gloss is by let me see what who is it by i don't know y'all i use this so much this is by la colors i get this from the dollar store and this is in the color fresh and this is what it looks like I don't know if you can see so it's like a very nude glossy color and the reason why i say this is my lucky charm is because if i don't have lip gloss especially this lip gloss with me i feel like my whole day is ruined i feel like that's what i'm going to bump into the ex that's what i'm going to bump into the chick that i didn't get along with in high school that's what i'm going to bump into you know the man of my dreams and he's going to be like oh her lips is chat <laughs> so without this lip gloss like you know it's just it's not a good day and with this i feel like anything is possible like even if you forgot all of those vibrant color lipsticks or your chapstick as long as that you have this lip gloss my favorite lip gloss my lucky charm 
I won't even sweat the situation, nor the day, nor the time. So I'm just laying y'all up. So now that we got that out the way, make sure y'all go ahead and check out Tiffany Baby TV. And you see how she responds to the exact same questions. So I do want to go ahead and show you what wig I am going to be reviewing today. So today I'm going to be re reviewing a Bobby Boss wig. And this is Tatiana in the color TT1B slash green. Now this is a 13 by 4 hand tied part. Now I did get this wig like maybe like two years ago. I never reviewed it. I got it from like an old hair website that no longer exists. But I'll make sure that I will include the link if they still sell this wig in the description box below. But this is a 14, a 13 by 4 hand tied lace part. So you will have some fun time in the parting area. If you want to left right on the part, you know, do your thing, however you swing. So here is the wig. Here is the gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous color wig. Very beautiful. It reminds me of a teal color, but it's green because I don't know if you can see, there are actually blue highlights in the green, which is what I really like. And it does have a 1B root. Here is the parting space. It does come with combs, one on the right, one on the left, one behind the back of the parting, one in the back with two adjustable straps. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to pop this baby on. And I'm going to show y'all how I style it just freely. Now, I don't know about y'all, but I don't always put adhesive on my wigs. Now, I want y'all to see how this wig lays. And there is no adhesive. You see how that looks? Very pretty. It lays really nice. Here's the hairline. And this is how it lays on the other side. Now, depending on how you shift your wig or how you place it, let me tell you something. This wig is already secured on my hairline. And honestly, I don't feel like I need to put any adhesive on it, which is very rare when it comes to a frontal wig. So I'm just going to go ahead. I'm just going to brush this out for you. I'm going to take my paddle brush. See if I get any shedding. I only received a couple of strands. Tilt it, shift it back a little bit. And yeah, y'all. This is your girl Tatiana. Tatiana. I'm gonna put a little bit of foundation in the parting. Now keep in mind, you have tons of parting space, but this is how the wig just laid. So I'm not mad at it. I'm going to keep it the way how it wants to be slayed, okay? I'm going to keep it laid the way how it's supposed to be slayed. That should be like, like a slogan or something. So y'all, this is Tantiana. She is so pretty and i'll put a little green in my eyebrows now the texture of this is like a light yakky texture which i love it because it definitely holds the curl a lot more it is very snug i would say it is big kid friendly just adjust your straps you will not need to use any adhesive on this frontal lace wig as y'all can see it is laying down Ooh, you know maybe if i just shift it a little bit more okay there we go so it is laying down. If you want to put a little bit on the tabs, you definitely can. Or if you want to do what I usually do, which is just take a little bit of the hair, put it behind my ear, and there you go. And that way you don't have to worry about the tabs showing if the wind blows. 
So also I want to show you the parting. Now you can part this a little bit more if you want to. It can go back a little bit more further if you want to. And it is very full, very curly, very luxurious. So I'm going to go ahead and give y'all 360. This is how the hair looks all in the front. This is how the hair looks on the left side. This is how the hair looks all in the back. And this is how the hair looks on the right side. So yeah, I really, really love this hair. I feel like it's sexy. I feel like this green gives it a little bit more oomph, especially for this quarantine St. Patty's Day. <laughs> So y'all let me know what y'all think about this wig. Let me know if you like it, love it, want to try it out, like the color, don't like the color, whatever it is, just make sure you be nice. And also make sure y'all check out Tiffany Baby TV's review after you are done watching mine. And most importantly, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I'm about to have too much fun with this wig and I feel like I'm going to be rocking this all week. So, like I say at the end of all of my videos, make sure you stay positive and make sure 